going to see how just changing the way you sound, changing the way you walk, changing the way you stand can make a whole difference in how others perceive you and how you feel about yourself. I'm Dr. Lillian Glass, so stay tuned and have some fun. Whoa! Whoa! That's too much energy! <laughs> Look, you scare me! <laughs> Yeah, I have a lot of energy. Tell, okay, now that's great. When you connect with somebody, you can't go, Hi, I'm Dr. Glass! <laughs> okay? You can't do that. You have to go, Hi, I'm Dr. Glass, and feel the person out. Connect. Great energy you have. Don't get me wrong, but it's too much. The wattage is too high. So the key is we have to be knowing before whom we stand. Thank you so much for trusting us. Great, thank you. Yep. You're not always that secure, am yep. I right? No, I work at it. You work at it, so hey. So we're gonna do a body language makeover right now. Oh, good. First of all, look at everybody in this room. I want you to think of them and be interested in them. Don't wow. think about you being interesting. Okay. Be interested. How does your body look when you're interested in them? A little more slack, a little <laughs> less tense, right? Mm -hmm. Now, I want you to think of everybody in that room. You could take that down. <laughs> I want you to just sense that everyone in this room adores you. Oh, yeah. So far, parents love you, mm -hmm. dog and husband, right. and the whole room. Yeah. Doesn't that make kind of you love you? Oh, I do love me. Well, let's <laughs> act it. So. <laughs> Pretend we don't know each other. We're gonna go up here. Hey, how are you? Hi, nice Talk to, to meet oh, you. Oh, good. So tell me about yourself. My name is Patrice. I'm from Minnesota. What a difference! Did you see it? Yeah. Okay. Do you see? Tell me. Tell everybody what you just experienced. Um, I don't have to shrink at all. That's right. At all. That's right. I thought I just shrank a little bit, but I shrink a lot. She does, and she'll never do that again. There's a warmth about her. I don't care what she's talking about. I want to know her. Did you hear that? When she's talking about, she's just kind of, she's easy to be, well, I don't know about that. But <laughs> Excuse me. She's easy to be with. She's comfortable. You feel comfortable in her presence. One thing I would say is I'd like your shoulders a little back. So we're all going to do a little shoulder exercise. One shoulder back, the other one back. One shoulder forward, the other shoulder forward. Both back and both forward. So look at the difference. OK, do you see the difference in her? She has a lot more confidence that's coming across. But she's warm and beautiful, and I'm so glad I met you. OK, sweetie, bye-bye. I'm going to go back home. I'm going to go back home. Always keep your head up and shoulders up. Now look at this posture. This is a little girl posture. This is a woman. You're not going to be that receptionist at the desk. You're going to be the powerful teacher. So show us how you're the powerful. Tell, tell us how you're going to teach. Power <laughs> Did you just see even that was great? Powerfully. She let it out. Good job. Good. She's confident. Anybody that puts their hands in back is making themselves vulnerable. So she's willing to get on a stage and be vulnerable. She's open. How great is that? So when you see people doing that, good sign. Good sign. Congratulations. Thank you. Now, what does that image say? It says something isn't right here. Either she, something's off. She's not solid. But now, when her feet or toes are pointed in my direction, and she has her head up, and she talks to me, what do you think? Tell me what we just did. I feel better. Tell me how you feel better. Um, I feel like I can talk to you better now. Exactly. She can talk to me better. She's connected to me. So if she's like this, she's off balance. If she's like this, she's off balance. But if her feet are connected, she's centered. You know the expression, your feet are planted on the ground? That's exactly what it means. Your feet are planted on the ground. Beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you for that lesson. You're great. Thank you. Thank so you, much. sweetie. Thank you. Um, I'm a drywall estimator. Uh-huh. Roseville, California. OK, but you know what that looks like to me? I'm a drywall <laughs> estimator, and I really don't want to do it. I hate it, and I can't stand it. I'm embarrassed to say it. But when I talk about drywall, I'm so embarrassed, and that's why I'm rocking back and forth. Am I kind yes. of on the same page as you? It's a huh? family company. I'm yeah, and I hate it, and I have to work with that 
loudmouth brother of mine and makes me sick and am I psychic and my husband who won't shut up ordered me around telling me what to do thinking he's the boss and he takes it home treats me like I'm uh, an employee in the house it's not gonna work how do I know this all from her voice you can tell everything so now talk to me about what you're gonna do with your new life um, I'm really excited about it it's totally changed my whole life did you hear what happened? Her voice got lower. I'm excited about it. Did you notice it in her body language? Yeah. Give her a hand. So the key is, here's the key. We're going to talk about your new life now, not your old okay. life. You're not going to be in the past. You're going to start living in the present. When you start living in the present, it's going to change your voice. Okay. It's going to change. Yeah, okay. See that? <laughs> See that? Welcome, everybody, to England. I welcome everybody to England and to London, which is a fantastic city. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And there's lots to discover there. <laughs> You're going to work on that, okay? When the so you can see people change their lives. You have literally seen little miracles. Everybody that had a body language makeover today is going to be a whole new person forever. And you say, well, wait a minute. I have to practice this and that. No. Just by being aware of what you need to do changes your whole life. Just by being aware that maybe I need to stand up a little bit. Maybe I need to watch my own energy, my own behavior. Maybe I need to just open my jaw, speak out. Wow, it's going to make a difference in your life. <laughs>